How do you do? I'm Dr. John Sace. Welcome to Urban Economics Advanced Topic Number One. In this video, we will develop a model for making local population projections using an exponential equation and the logarithmic process. Following this method, we will estimate the compounding average annual growth rate for an urban area. U.S. Census populations are taken every 10 years. Given that information, we start by dividing a recent census population by one from a decade earlier. For our example, let's assume that City Alpha had a population of 895,620 persons in the year 2000 and that this represents a notable increase over the 1990 population of 794,694. We calculate the 10-year increase by dividing the 2000 population by the 1990 population and then subtract the dividend from one. In this example, we divide 895,620 by 794,694 to get the value of 1.127. Subtracting 1 from this value leaves us with R sub D, the decimal growth rate of 0.17, which is 12.7%. This represents the population increase over a decade. However, we want to find the average annual growth rate over this period of time. Therefore, we begin by adding the decimal growth rate back to one, which renders the sum of 1.127. Then, we take this sum to the exponential power of one over n, where n is the number of years. In the case of one decade, n equals 10, and our resulting equation equals 1.127 to the 1 tenth point one power. Next, we take the log of this exponential function. This gives us the expression of the quantity, 1 over n, times the log of the quantity of 1 plus r sub d. In our example, this equals 0.1 times 0 0.05192, which in turn equals 0 0.005192. Now, we solve for the annual growth rate. To do this, we take the value of n to an exponential power equal to the quantity 1 over n times the log of quantity, which is 1 plus r sub d. So in our example, we take the value of 10 years to the power of 0 0.005192. The result is 1 plus large R sub A, in which large R sub A is the compounded average annual growth rate. In our example, the total value is 1.012. Subtracting 1 from this value leaves us with R sub A, which is point 0.012 or in decimal form 1.2 percent per annum. Because of the annual compounding that gives us a decade rate of almost 13 percent, the average annual rate is less than one-tenth of the decade rate. I hope this has helped you. If it has, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment for topics that you would care to view. Thank you and have a great day.